es una ciudad que tiene muy poquita superficie verde. El Ayuntamiento de Barcelona tiene un programa de recuperación de paredes medianeras. Esto es algo muy de Barcelona, que quedan muchas paredes de estas sueltas que los cambios urbanísticos han dejado descubiertos. Desde el punto de vista más de la ciudad, intervenir en estas superficies que en un primer momento no se nos hubiera ocurrido de que se puede intervenir con verde, es una manera de, de incrementar la superficie de verde de la ciudad. There exists a tradition in vertical garden, la gruta, but it's very expensive because the maintenance must be made by outside. So when a plant is dead, you need to go with a brain and change. Esto es, digamos, la parte interior de esta gran maceta vertical, de esta medianera verde, para poderla regar, abonar, cambiar con mucha facilidad. Aquí la posibilidad es que tienes desde aquí muy fácil acceso para cambiar las plantas, para el tubo del, del riego o abonarlo. Porque si no, si hacemos una cosa muy difícil, que tienes que llegar con grúa, es un problema porque no se hace y aparte es muy caro. Incluso estas cajas lo que puedes es sacarlas y reponerlas. Entonces se vacían y se pueden cambiar. Aquí tenemos una caja tipo y entonces el módulo es sencillo de reponer. Y aquí también hay una pequeña, digamos, caja como de un ascensor que hay una polea para poder subir y bajar las herramientas. Si te fijas, todo está montado como si fuese un mecano. Todas las piezas están atornilladas con estos... Eh, se hizo todo en, en taller a piezas pequeñitas y se llegó aquí y se fue montando todo. Paisacha Urba is the institution who take care about the look of the city and they want to finish with this kind of walls that are very ugly is a medianera ciega it's not just an aesthetic issue this is a big filter they calculate how many kilos of co2 filter this i don't remember but it's a huge Also, this is a very good filter for contamination. The leaf take the micro dust from uh, cars and comes here, they absorb that. Also, is uh, good for protect the building. You avoid the direct rays of the sun. This is a natural protection. This project is like a big tree. You make shadow and the tree protect the pedestrian and to this building uh, and at the same time is producing oxygen. It's like a tree, same. And the tree is also for birds. Nest. It's nest. Yes. It's also a kind of biodiversity mm -hmm. because this is full of insects and this is, is life. This is a different kind of birds that can be here, but it's also the possibility for gecko and also for bat. This space is like a cave. This is a big urban tree made in, in steel. So what were the neighbors' reactions? Well, they, they, they was a little worried about the animals, about the bears, about insects, 
oh, this means insects. So, uh, in fact, the urban people were a little um, sick. Because insect, nature is evil. If it's yes, in the city. Yeah. And, and the city is safe. And, but now they, uh, they are very happy and people enjoy and many people come here. You can look up and discover more than 20 kinds of plants. I love a kind of uh, ism in architecture that is new and the name is vegetecture. So it's a vegetal architecture. The slogan is bring the forest to the city. So it's to uh, come again to put the nature between us in the city because the process uh, is changed. You know? This area was full of trees. The human being come here, start to build, make the city comfortable, but we lose many things and we become contaminated cities. So now it's time to bring again the forest to the city.